Hi, I'm Matt. I'm a tattoo artist from Syracuse, New York, but I make other things too. And today I'm going to show you some bird houses that I did. All right, let's get started. Everything begins with a sketch and I'm doing my sketches on my iPad gonna make three of these bird houses so I'm gonna make three faces all right now that my sketches are done I am moving on to the hard line work basically I'm just creating this outline so that when I'm ready to transfer it over to the wood everything's gonna be a lot smoother and easier to see just about finished and gotta work on those chompers they look like crap so fix those up real quick print it out now that everything is printed out, I'm tracing it over onto the wood with some stencil paper. It's time to start cutting. For this part, I'm just using my jigsaw so I can get all those little precision details in there around the edges. Moving on to paint. So my wife is helping me with this part and we're just using some old acrylics that we had laying around. One of the things that I kind of regret about this project was sizing down my drawings after I started them. Uh, everything that I'm doing is using 1x6s, which you can see me cutting here. But the fronts were much larger. I used some scrap wood that I had laying around, which was about 10 inches wide. And I think that next time I'll take advantage of the extra wood and just go a little bit wider with the front. That way I can paint a little bit easier. Building the birdhouses wasn't too difficult, and that's the reason that I chose this project as my first video. I mean, I've never really built a birdhouse before. I made some shitty feeders for my mom when I was a kid, but we, we, won't, uh, we won't show any of those. <laughs> Anyways, um, here I'm just adding the final details onto the uh, fronts of the birdhouses with a paint marker, just to make them look a little bit more tiki-esque. While I finish up the fronts of the birdhouses, my wife's painting the backs with the same paint that we used for our shed and our deck, which you can see hasn't been painted at the time of the video, but it is now, so we're all good. Had a lot of fun doing this, and I can't wait to make some more tiki stuff to match these. Sarah and I have a pretty big tropical collection, and two rooms of our house are kind of modeled around that. So we decided to carry that over into the backyard a bit. I've got some other projects planned, and a lot of things are going to follow the tiki theme. So I'll make sure I make some videos about those too. If you've got ideas for me, uh, things that you would like to see me make, now, just keep in mind, I'm not really a woodworker, I'm just an artist. If you have ideas, drop them in the comments, I'd love to hear about them.
<laughs> well, finished up my bird houses. Uh, I think they look pretty cool. Yeah, it was fun. I got to use power tools, got to do some painting with my wife. So yeah, everything was, everything was really fun. That's fun. I uh, got all those bird feeders. Ooh, they're not bird feeders, they are bird houses. Okay. <sighs>